Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, the world of biosciences is evolving. It's a small field with grander opportunities for all of you, but only for those who reach out. Yes, you heard me right. Today's video's title is Networking, its importance and how to do. And I'm going to give you some practical insights on what you should be doing today that will change your future tomorrow. So let's start with science. You, you are pursuing science, you are studying science. So you must know the science of human thinking, how humans think. Now, if I am today sitting in Bangalore and you are sitting in some distant part of West Bengal, suppose, and you're watching this video and you want to, you know, get to know me or um, introduce yourself to me, you don't need to take an appointment. All you need is one simple, sweet comment. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, you heard me right. We today are much more powerful than we think we are. Networking should be your core engine to success in your career. And how do you do that? Let me give you some practical aspects also, as well as some importance. Now, of course, networking will improve your career opportunities. That's the first important benefit. It will improve your career opportunities. It will give you more industry insights than anyone else. It will help you in professional development. You will develop better than others. Now, it will help you in collaborating with others. And definitely, it will help you build reputation. So these, these are the five quick points of benefits of networking. But now, how do you do it? Now, here is a point I want to tell you. If I need something and if I go and demand from some random stranger on the, on the internet or on the road, do you think that person will give me anything? No. But if I am active on social media, say LinkedIn, and I am publishing some story or somebody published a story, I go and comment, like it, comment nice things about it, reach out to that person you know, in person and say, I really loved your story. Help somebody get a job. Help someone who, whom you helped in the past through social media. Help um, someone who needs help but is a stranger to you today. That's how you do networking. If you think that I just, I'll just go on uh, social media and ping some random CEO that I need a job, you'll get the job. No, it's not like that. If you just go randomly on internet and somebody has posted that I'm looking for this XYZ scientist, you comment below and say, say interested, you'll get a job. No, you'll not. Instead, what you need to do is you need to help someone to get helped. You need to reach out, impress someone to get noticed. So in today's world, networking is all about getting noticed, helping others, and then whenever you need help, asking for help. I know out of 100 people, 99 will not help. But you just need help from one person and that person may be in that crowd you, whom you're thinking are of no use. So all you have to do today is reach out. Reach out to me. Reach out to all the you know, professionals in your class through LinkedIn. Make a reputation. Help others. Help a stranger get a job. You, whenever you see a job on Biotechnica, repost it on LinkedIn. Whenever you see some important workshop being, being conducted, post it on your network and also mention why you are posting that I want to help someone you know, who may be in need. So please go through this import, important piece of information. That's how you make your profile valuable. That's how you network. That's how you help. That's how you get helped. You help 100 people, 99, 99 will not help you, but you need help from one person. That's the mantra of networking. I landed with great deals with amazing biotech companies. I'm in connection with amazing CEOs of various biotech and pharma companies, all because I did networking. So all you have to do as a fresher or as an experienced candidate is just make yourself valuable, add more value. And how do you do that? Networking is one of the best ways. It's the core engine towards your career growth. So do not delay. Network, the first step starts with me. Come network with me. Let's sit together and discuss how can I help you in your career. Let's come together to promote biosciences. Let's come together to, together to help a microbiologist, biochemist, cell biologist, whatever maybe in our network who needs help. 
and then you see how your reputation compounds, how you grow in your field. So this is my quick message to all of you. Remember the five benefits of networking and that is you'll have more career opportunities, you'll build a reputation, you'll have more industry insights, you'll have better professional development and you will be able to do collaborative work, collaborative research in the world. Remember, your demands can never be met if you just go and demand. First, you have to fulfill someone else's demand. That's how you will, your demands will be quenched. So with these thoughts, I'll end this video. Thank you so much for watching. Stay subscribed and I'll see you soon in the next one. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.